we only have one statue and it's in a place of prominence in the community, right at the entrance to our downtown. And now that we are aware, and maybe some were, but now that I'm aware of the fact that he was not only a slave owner, but that he worked to keep slavery legal in Illinois, um, I, I, I don't see that as that he was a man of his time issue. I, I think that he, I think that owning other people across history has always been bad and always will be bad. And so I, I think that we as a city have to act. And, and I think that one of the best suggestions that has been made is not to remove it, um, but to relocate it. But when it comes to relocating it, the more I've thought about this, I don't think we would be well served just relocating it. We have two options, really, that's the Madison County Historical Society, and my understanding is they have no interest in, in acquiring it uh, for a number of reasons. And then the other is the Stevenson House, which very similar, I don't, think they particularly want to acquire it either. So I'm not really sure I'm in favor. If the statue is removed, if, if we form a committee that looks at all sides of this debate and they come back with, say, you know, take it down, I think it just gets taken down. I don't really think relocating it solves anything. I think relocating it to an, an educational, a place of education like the Stevenson House or a historical museum actually gives it an opportunity for its history to be known. What if they don't want it? Well, you're right, that could be the case. But I think that is the appropriate setting to talk about this individual's past. Um, I mean, m much more so maybe than a plaza at the entrance to our downtown. Um, I, I think there's more opportunities for education for interpretation at a museum. We need a vote, and I support the relocation the removal and relocation of the statue. To me, the vote is about respecting them, their feelings. People actually live, serve in this community. It's about the feeling that I think this community has overall that we're an inclusive place.